Hi guys, this is MC, AC's in the background, and today I thought of something that would be really, really cool. I would like to call it the Top Gear Challenge. So, what we're going to do is, we're going to get two cars, two really old cars, and we are going to race them. But I don't know if AC has any money, so... Well, I just kind of check. I bought a really old Maserati just now. MC. I don't know if you guys can hear it or not. So that's my car. So I'm going to try them out when they're really, really slow. But first, I got to let him go in the car. There you go. Oh yeah, I forgot. Hold on. Oh, never mind. Just remembered something. Free play. Select the car. You can use this card for free. Oh and yeah, I forgot. Earn credits. I didn't start for AC on this one. So this might take a while. First, we're just gonna get him some money so he can buy a car. The, the car on the screen is a 2017 Ford GT. I saw it at the car show. I went to the car show most of the time, most of my life. Yeah, me too. No, you didn't. You remember the car? We only went twice. We we went to the car show twice. Wait, oh. You. Well, I Just didn't. be quiet. Is it to prove how fast we are? How far we can go? Do we race to find our place? The introduction is very boring. To be part of something greater. To face fear. SRT Audi R8 LMS Ultra to grow stronger um. to become immortal. Captain America stuck in war. Which one was? Be quiet. In truth, there is no simple answer to why we race. There is only the fact that we always will. Now first I'm gonna do this first race for him. Welcome to the Segueto Jajillo, a course that takes drivers from the shores of Copacabana Beach to the vistas of Corcovado Mountain. I'm here to give you your first look and first drive of the spectacular 2017 Ford GT on the colorful streets of Brazil's marvelous city. So there it is, 2017 Ford GT. I heard this from AR12 that there is actually a 4K um, 
4K high definition, so yeah, I know it wouldn't be an audio room to check in. Sorry, I pressed something. Okay. These guys are cheaters. They have no cars? Be quiet. I've never heard of those ones before. I'm just getting him some money so that later we could do the challenges and we would have the cars that we need. I have a lot more cars than him. Oh, this is MC driving. Just gonna have to cross over here. And I passed them. Almost there to the checkered flag. Yeah, I know the car is very, very damaged. But it's okay. About to beat McLaren. Oh, my profile I have um, <coughs> Lamborghini Hurricane, and that golf was just me choking on my own saliva. So, I do have a Lamborghini Hurricane, it is the fastest car I have yet because one has 10.0 top speed, 10.0 acceleration. 6.3 and 6.3 braking and handling. Fastest one yet. New lap record. You did it. Congratulations. You have completed your first race. Thank you. Now I'll give you a quick primer before starting your career. Mm. Your career spans five different volumes. Good for each me. built around a different type of car passion. Good. From hot hatchbacks and vintage sports cars. Amazing. To grand touring cars and formula racers. Amazing. You will drive and collect the greatest cars in the world. Cool. But first, I'll guide you through a short three race qualifying series. Well, I don't think we're gonna be able to do all three races. So he's gonna have to rent a car. And where is my remote? Oh, there it is. Your first qualification race takes place at Lime Rock Park, known for its flowing elevation changes and rural setting. We've assembled a roster of truly iconic cars from the Super Street volume to use for qualifying. All these cars have been upgraded. Hey, see, choose match. one. So choose the one that speaks to you, and we'll get started. Okay. I pick the red one. Okay. okay. I want Great the red. choice. Now let's customize it to really make it yours. Red. I like it red. 
but now you won't have time for this. So, yeah. So, AC is just going to have to rent a car. We finally have beanbag chairs for once. Yeah, guys. We have beanbag chairs. <laughs> If you don't have one, you just buy it at the store. Turns out he doesn't want to race anymore. I do want to race. Oh, Mark, what's going on? Just go, ready. Doesn't seem to be that he doesn't that he knows how to listen. So I'm just gonna just test drive my car. First, let's see how bad it is. With a drag racing. Quarter mile. Full mile drag race. Remember, I just got this car, but I had to sell my Bentley racing car because one, I didn't like it. I can tell this car has a lot of potential in it. I can tell you that. It's also a rear wheel drive. Let's just take a little quick tour of it. Not much to see, but it's a lovely looking car. Let's start. Really good engine. Set. Go. What is this car? C class? A D class? Hold on. It's a C class. This thing is fast. This thing has a lot of potential in it. I can see a bright future for this car. A very bright future. 130 miles an hour. 140 miles an hour. 150! 152.8 people! 152.8! That was awesome! Let's go and check the tuning and see how fast. A hundred and eighty miles an hour. This car needs a lot of help. Let's see what I can do. This car looks awesome. First, let me check what. Really? No. 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 Not happening, never will. Just looking at the upgrades that I could put on it. What kind of spokes? I would say around big open spokes. Nope. Yeah, no, not big open spokes. Medium spokes. This one speaks out a lot. That one speaks out a lot. That one too. But first, let's see if this thing can really reach 180 miles an hour. Homestead, Miami. My grandmother lives in Florida. Cuba just wants a lot of love. They want freedom. That's why they escape here. We have freedom! Okay, I will not be talking for the... Until half of this track. Well, I will be talking in the background because of how fast this thing will be. A lot of potential.
AC. I'm just checking something out. AC, are you gonna race? Yeah. Then stay. Yeah, because you wanted to go and see Dad and what he was doing. Let's see, what is this do I have? He always has to talk. Even with traction control, this thing has good handling. Traction control off. Oh, my mistake. That failed. But that, at that time, that, that was my fault. This car has a lot of potential in it. I can see how this can be an amazing racing car. But I don't think AC will be using, like, an old car. Because, one, he doesn't have any money. It's not even his profile. Three, it's Casey's profile. And four, she rare she rarely even plays the Xbox. Uh, power This thing has a lot of potential. I know I keep on saying that, but I actually do mean it. Normal car to drive out on the road, but it is very fast. If you were me and in my footsteps, you would understand. 165, 166, 167, 168, 169, 170, 171, 172, 173, 174, 175, 176, 176! Very close. But this car is a very good car. For all you people hating on Maserati, that's your fault. If you have Forza 6 and you get this, you will understand how good it is. This car is definitely a keeper. And you're asking, like, where's AC? Well, he's just drinking his juice. He'll enter soon. Just after this race. I'm gonna race him on this exact circuit. I do like this Maserati. I just hate the new GB. G H B I, I think. I'm a real car fanatic. It's just I don't pay attention to Maserati that much. The ones that I would usually pay attention to is McLaren, Ferrari, Kenexeg, Lamborghini, Bugatti. What else? I think there was one more. Not Lexus. I know there was one more, right? Noble. I know they only made one car, but it is fast. Just stock, it's fast. 225 miles an hour, stock. You can't tell me that is not fast. Because that is very fast. Most cars can't even catch that. This car is good in corners. And after this, I'm gonna go on to multiplayer, and I'm just gonna wreck everyone's face with a Maserati, an old Maserati. Probably tag, not drag racing, because then I would have to fully max it out. Mm, yeah. Wow, four minutes. Four minutes went by pretty fast. 
Oh my god, the dodging of those cones. Ow. They do a lot of damage to it. Well, it wasn't much. Old cars compared to new cars. Old cars are made out of original metal. Now cars are made out of plastic aluminum and stuff, which makes them very light, but very, very fragile. Yeah, this car has a lot of potential in it. In real life, I would definitely recommend buying this car. Oh, it's the GHIBI. I like the old GHIBI. The old DB. It's really cool. Here's your remote. But first, let me put on the car. There we go. Um, his car has to be a level C. So let me just sort this. Okay, what Maseratis are there that are in C level? The Mira. <laughs> He's beating me by 10. There you go, AC. Choose a car. Just choose a car. You know you could go to the side, right? I did that because there was only one green car, so I went to the side and there was two cars. I picked this one. There were more. You know that, right? Yes. Alright, let's see if you can beat this Maserati. And this time, AC, after you drive like you know how to. Don't crash into the walls. So the for the remainder we will not talk of this map of this race. And there will be another episode about this one. But after, I will make the car faster. my younger sibling. Ooh. Have you guys ever played Burnout? If you have, drop a like down below because I could probably make a video for that. I have collected most of the cards. Not all. Forty-five. Wonder how fast AC's car goes. Wonder how fast AC's car can and go. Catching up. He's trying to kill me. I know it. I can't believe this car has six gears. I thought it would have five. I don't 
first place. Well, I passed you, so yeah. on the right, that is your gears, not your place. The big numbers? Yes. I think like you've never played this game before. I think I just didn't know what the big numbers Okay, first up, we're gonna give us our, we're gonna give you guys our real name. My name is Morgan. Casey's real name is Amy. And then Casey's real name is Kayla. And that's what you should know. And I'm so relieved. I don't want to use that name anymore. I like this car. That's actually the color of our bean bag chairs. Mm -hmm. Is that yours is like a, a big color? Mine is a dark. darker blue. It looks like a dark blue for you, but I don't know what could mine looks like. A dark guy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Am I doing good, Morgan? Yeah, I would say yes. I didn't even crash into the corner really well. I didn't even crash into any. I didn't even crash into it. Surprisingly. No, I just chose to drift that corner. If I had, I would have passed him. I do. So, in the second episode, uh, hmm. I like the Minecraft video. You remember more when I was talking about nothing and I you remember you were never in the Minecraft video. And it was like get out my village, the village. Yeah, and then I killed you. Yeah, you killed me. You killed me in that Minecraft. Yeah, this is a rear wheel drive car. I'm turning so good. The thing is that front wheel drive cars are much easier to handle in drifting. I rear wheel drive cars are a lot harder. Morgan. Seeing that the front isn't the one that's moving the car. And all wheel drive is just, I don't know. I never actually tried all wheel drive. I'm s you said you said good. You're right. I'm driving really good. I, I. This is better than normal. Drop a like down below, like right now. Yeah, right. Now. right. <laughs> your car's a Bye bye. Morgan, your car's. And you don't even know what that means. Just stop saying it. I know. Your car's really cool. Thank you. This is where we're going to have to end the video. Oh, bye-bye. Bye, -bye. bye uh, guys. Thank you. Bye, guys. In go.